Welcome guys to another quick tech video guide. This video guide will make you learn how you can install and run Fedora 38 server with manual partitions on any of your system. On your screens you must be seeing Fedora 38 installer boot screen. You can get the link to Fedora 38 bootable installer ISO image in the description of this video. Let's give it a go with pace and start the Fedora 38 installer. The initial boot may take a while. Please have patience during this. On this welcome screen you need to choose your installation language. Choose it and hit continue to move ahead. This is the installation summary page. We will set up things one by one here. Let's start with installation destination and create the partitions for our Fedora 38 server installation. Follow the on-screen instruction for creating the necessary partitions. Please note that this installation instructions are for systems booting from UEFI boot. So that an FE system partition is needed for correct boot of the operating system. In the software selection menu choose the set of software and applications you want to install on your server. You can either choose your preferred applications or can also move ahead with the default set of applications. Choice is all yours. Now it's time to choose your region and locations. Choose it wisely. The last and the important step is to enable the root account and create a standard user account. Follow the on-screen instructions for this. Choose a strong and healthy password. All done wisely. Now all you have to do is to click on Begin Installation to start the Fedora 38 server installation. This can roughly take 5 to 10 minutes. We will fast forward the video to save your time. You must be seeing the installation is completed successfully. Just click Reboot System to reboot and start the newly installed Fedora 38 server. Welcome to Fedora 38 server. Please log in with your created user credentials. Let's install a package with DNF. Fedora 38 server is successfully installed and running absolutely fine. Let's see how it works through a web interface. Open your internet browser on any of your other PC and navigate to localhost with shown port and enter the shown IP manually.
Log in with your user credentials on to this web console. Now you have all your Fedora 38 server details through localhost. You can virtually operate your Fedora 38 server from in here. You can update your server, install any package and get all your server details from this interface. That's all for this. I hope you liked the content. If you have any queries regarding the installation, you can ask in the comments. Good luck.